We assembled this morning to commemorate the groundbreaking for the Department of Homeland Security Consolidated Headquarters at St. Elizabeth. The ceremony of groundbreaking for the DHS on this secure federal campus will serve as a catalyst in the revitalization of the District of Columbia's Ward 8. As Acting Regional Administrator for the National Capital Region, I am proud and honored to be a part of this momentous occasion in our nation's history as we embark on this unique landmark project. Thank you for joining us this morning. Ladies and gentlemen, please join me in welcoming the Secretary of the Department of Homeland Security, Janet Napolitano. Thank you, what a great day, what a great event that we all can share and how appropriate that it occur on the week of the anniversary of uh, September the 11th, which after all, uh, that attack on our homeland was the genesis of the recognition by the Congress led by Chairman Lieberman uh, that we needed a Department of Homeland Security. And let me thank the chairman, let me thank the congresswoman for their leadership efforts. Uh, let me thank as well uh, all of the other honored guests who are here today, but most particularly the men and women who are here today uh, who serve at the Department of Homeland Security. Some of you have been here from the very beginning. Uh, some of you have just joined the department. Uh, but all of you share a commitment to the safety and security of the people of the United States. And I think uh, the people of the United States can be proud of, of your efforts. And it is a privilege to be able to serve as, as your secretary. Um, one of the most important things that we have been asked to do at the Department of Homeland Security uh, is to connect the dots. Uh, and to make sure that as uh, different pieces of intelligence are received or as different crises emerge, uh, that they are dealt with in a unified way uh, by a department that shares a common sense of purpose, mission, and culture. In other words, we are one DHS. Uh, and to fulfill that purpose, having a unified headquarters will be so very, very helpful. It will help us to streamline our communication. It will help us to, it will help us to hold meetings. Um, uh, and it will help us, as I said, to build that culture of one DHS. Uh, in addition, uh, the location of this unified headquarters uh, is so very, very important. Um, here, uh, with our partner, the General Service Ad Services Administration, uh, we can, I think, be active participants and neighbors uh, with this area of the district, uh, and an active and valued part of this community, just as we are an active and valued part of our nation as a whole. Uh, we look forward to working with the GSA on the uh, construction of this project. And I can't close without commenting uh, that we would not be here today uh, but for the decision of the Congress at the behest of President Obama uh, to put $650 million in Recovery Act funds toward the St. E's campus, uh, which has allowed us to greatly accelerate uh, the campus's construction, and by that, will allow us not just to create jobs in this area right now, uh, but to accelerate uh, the actual construction and hopefully move-in date of our, of our new national headquarters. So uh, thank you to all who have made this day possible. Thank you to all who are here who serve our country every day. And I look forward uh, to the work here at St. E's and to the continued strengthening of the Department of Homeland Security. Thank you. Thank you.